Hello, I'm back again with my HTC Touch Cruise and I'm gonna boot it up for the first time so let's go I just put a 4 gigabyte um, SIM card in sorry <laughs> I mean a micro SD card in so 4 gigs so uh, let's see what uh, how this phone looks like so maybe some small configurations before um, I can use it but um, then I will come back if I have to lay down my uh, N95 that I'm taping this with so I really like this phone it's neat that's very good in the hand I put on the uh, protection on the screen so Let's see. It will take some time for Windows Mobile to start up uh, the first time. I had a Titan 2. Uh, it was the, the same. The really first time you started up. So it's uh, it's normal. A little configuration. Let's see, time zone, Norway, yeah, we'll take this later. starting we'll take some time with this customization it's gonna be a long wait in the video for people to watch this because this takes some time, but uh, I haven't seen any other videos uh, starting up the uh, HDT Touch Cruise the the first time, so it's good to have a video like that too. I haven't taken uh, off this yet. So, but I will. Come on, come on, come on. Long wait.
I'm curious how the touch flow works on this one. I, I've uh, never used a HTC touch with a touch flow like the cube and so on. Let's see how that works now. Pretty neat phone. I have to say that. I like it. I like it a lot. So really hope something happens now. Hey, it's booting up. Smart mobility, it says. The screen. I'm sorry about the reflection of uh, from my mobile phone that I'm filming with. But uh, I guess you'll live with it. Yeah. You have to be patient. <laughs> there it is. The HTC. Pretty neat. There it is. This nice phone. It's really nice. So There's the cube. It works pretty well, I think. Cool. Just take it down. There it is. Okay. Now uh, you have seen a part of my video. So if you have any questions, you just ask me. Okay. See you later. Bye.